Parson Gauri to continue in his uh, left arm orthodox fashion, following the spinners from round the wicket to chapel. Straight back to Emerson O'Neill has gone. Quarter bowled by Garvey. Well, my goodness. Chapel losing concentrations for just a half second there, smashing it back down the ground. And Garvey never at any stage looked as if he was going to drop that. Very nonchalant take by Garvey and uh, most unusual shot from Greg Chapel, who's battled very hard here at the MCG. Ball was up there to be driven, but not quite to the pitch of the ball. And Garvey, just as a matter of fact, just putting the hands down and throwing it into the air. And the end of Greg Chapel and certainly a good breakthrough for the Indians and coming not through the pace bowling of Garvey but by him bowling his left arm orthodox spinners and most unusual method of dismissal for Greg Chapel who now the Australians for 189 Greg Chapel has had some tense moments at the start of some of his recent innings and here today facing his first ball from Garvey there's not the slightest need to consult the umpire oh there's a big shot, he's bowling round his legs. What a sensation at the moment to the ground. Chapel from too far across, bowled without scoring, and what a match now. The great fun of the season, clean bowled by Carson Garvey. Look at the Indians, they're alive. What a match. And we've got a cricket match on our hands now. This was a nasty delivery to receive. Ball very short indeed, keeping low, cutting back from outside the leg stump, and tilting, canting that leg stump back and an elated Carson Garvey claims the second wicket and how rarely you see that little figure following Greg Chappell to the pavilion I suppose, uh, Bill, you've got to fail sometime Yes, it's 2 for 11 